But yeah, I'd say competitiveness has always been in there. So how does that help you on the mound? Just not giving in. I mean, we always talk about bending and not breaking. So whatever the situation may be, good, bad, ugly, just bending and not breaking, trusting the team behind you, trusting our plan of attack. He spent the first three or four weeks last year trying to convince you guys you were good. <laughs> well, now clearly you realize you were good last year. Like you said, it's a new slate, but you have the experience. And you can help the new guys in that department. What's that been like to assimilate them and make them understand the culture now? Honestly, it was easy. It was it was easy, and it was a lot easier than I thought it'd be. I mean, 25 new guys coming in on the roster, trying to. I mean, that's half the team. Trying to trying to get half the team on, on board with the other half. It, it can be tough, but those guys were so receptive. I mean, everybody, the transfers, the freshmen, they were just so receptive and. and willing to, to dive into this culture that, that we've, we've created and started. And so it was just awesome. It was really easy. I would say, honestly, our second or third week in the scrimmages, we were clicking and, and we were used to each other, and it was just it was awesome. And so it's just I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a good team. Good you guys team told here. us last year that, that Omaha was an abstract <laughs> to you guys preseason last year. And, uh -huh. and now, you know, it's real, or at least it seemed, because you were so close last year. Is that really a help to you? Yeah, and, and like you said last year, coach had to convince us, but now the only convincing that it took was us convincing the new guys coming in, and that was re that was even quicker than anything that's been done. So, coach really didn't have to do any convincing for us in that regard. So, I mean, it's been Omaha since about day one.